Hello friends, you are with me Dr. Raj Shekhar, you are here to learn about research. Today we are going to uh, have a look at uh, what's the difference between quantitative research approach and qualitative research approach. Because the research approaches, these two things are the very, very important. Either your research whether either fall into the quantitative or qualitative, sometime, sometime you may employ both. That type of research approach is called mixed method research. Mixed method approach. So now I am going to talk about the main difference between uh, quantitative and qualitative. So first of all, quantitative is very simple. As the word defines quantity, it talks about quantity, numbers, and the uh, uh, what you call all about numbers, figures, and other things. Whereas quality, it will talk about very deep things about certain words. It will talk about more analysis and words. It will not simply uh, what you call uh, with with the only the words. For example, quantity quantitative research will tell you that what is the exact difference. But uh, the quantitative research will not tell how the difference is. But whereas qualitative research, it will not tell what is the exact difference. It will tell the quality of the difference. Say, I speak, in, uh, there are five students, they speak English in different way and probably the quantitative research will say that three students speak like a native speaker, two students speak like a non-native speaker. Whereas qualitative research will tell them what are the words they used as a native speaker. For example, does the sound, the instead of measure, they used to measure in that way, how the mother tongue is influenced. So they'll, they'll analyze, they'll picturize, they'll go in detail about their errors and other things. Whereas the quantitative, it will not go in detail, only it will give the vertical figures. And second important thing, quantitative research will only test the hypothesis and theories. If there is a theory, the research will fund what you call, employ, it will try to build on uh, testing the theory as well as the hypothesis. But whereas qualitative research, it will not test the theory, it will formulate the new theory. Because quant quality, it will never test the theory, it will formulate new theory. And here it is, it is a more of mathematical analysis and statistical analysis. There it is analysis, content analysis, analysis of the words, in the discourse analysis, in that way the analysis goes. Uh, in the quality and qualitative, but whereas in quantitative, it is only more of mathematical analysis, more of on what you call the statistical. We employ statistical tools to analyze the data in the quantitative uh, approach. We don't employ any uh, statistical tool because we don't what you call uh, deal with more data in the qualitative research. Uh, data means here. You will have large number of data you will collect for the quantitative research, whereas here in the qualitative research data will be very limited. Say for example, the case study method. The case study method for if you do it the same case study in the uh, uh, majority of the cases, case study will be done in the qualitative research. The quantitative research means it will ask only the, the you will give the questionnaire, you will record the responses, that response will be coded with the numbers. You don't exactly know down what their responses. But whereas in the qualitative research, they would record the responses, they will interpret their responses. But here, their responses are not interpreted. They are actually, uh, based on their responses, it is quantified and presented through certain graphs and figures that these many students like this, these many students don't like it. But here, why do they like it? What are the parameters involved for their like, what you call liking or disliking, all these things will be analyzed. So, the uh, participants in the quantitative is high and qualitative is very less. The next parameter is when the, the analysis about the employability of statistical tools, it's not there in the qualitative, it's only there in the quantitative research. If you look at the another important parameter, and, and uh, in case you are using the question means in the interview questions, in the quantitative research, they will ask only multiple choice closed questions, so you will, you will select only one answer. Whereas in the qualitative research, it will be open-ended question, for example, what are the difficulties you face in speaking English? 
This is the open-ended question, the qualitative research. But whereas in the quantitative research, they'll say that well, the difficulties you are facing in speaking English, grammar, vocabulary, pronunciation, they'll give three options. You will select any, any one option. But whereas here, they'll try to get to know about everything. And whether, uh, next thing is here, mainly it, what you call, they, they try to test, measure the uh, uh, based on the uh, hypothesis. But here, they don't worry about measuring the hypothesis. They try to build the hypothesis. Next thing, based on the qualitative re research approach and the quantitative research approach, the research design will change. For example, as I already told you that one example is data collection. Data collection for quantitative approach is different and qualitative approach is different because here datas are very limited but you will go in depth. Whereas in the quantitative research, the datas are very large data but you will try to analyze the data but you will not go to the individual data in detail. So these are the main differences between qualitative and quantitative research. And I'll tell you exact research methodology what you need to employ for the quantitative approach and the qualitative approach in the, uh, the next video. And if you like this video, please do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. And please share to your friends so that let them get benefited. I'll meet you in the next video. Bye-bye.